Hey everybody, my name is Gunnimo. Welcome back for another video of Star Wars The Old Republic. We finished off uh, the Dragon Ball expansion like two videos. That wasn't very long. There wasn't much to do until there's anything else coming out that we're going to just continue to play this game. I mean, there's nothing else really going on. This guy keeps switching between the two. I don't know what the fuck he's doing. Start this, uh, let's continue this shit up, boys. We're going to see what's, uh, what's going on here. Oh, that's right. We were supposed to meet with her. I completely forgot about that. I require your attention. Do not tarry. What you want to meet me for? Everyone wants to meet me. Okay, I thought I had uh, to talk to her. Never mind then. I'll just go talk to Scorpio. I don't know what she wants, boys, but uh, does she has something for me to do. Let's find that out, I guess. Gotta go here. Let me take the speeder really quick. It's gonna go up much faster. Good. You're here. Astute observation, Agent Shaw. It is a wonder the SIS could get by without your deductive reasoning. You're a droid that's gotten too big for her own bolts. How's that for an astute observation? Five minutes. Can we please go five minutes without you two at each other's throats? <laughs> I mean, I like that. The fact that we're at each other's throat. And she can talk shit to Terran all she wants. I don't like Terran. I hate this guy. So you're acting like children. Starting now. Go. Well, stop wasting time. You know what? You're acting like uh, children, all of you. Scorpio, don't be rude. And Theron, you know better than to give into her taunt. Sorry. Stress got the better of me. Scorpio, show the commander what you found. Please. My analysis of enemy communications obtained by Havoc Squad revealed something interesting. Hidden inside a mundane signal, I discovered an encrypted transmission was codenamed the Gemini Frequency. They are broadcast from the throne to every vessel in the Eternal Fleet. The Spire schematics provided by Kalir confirm this. It's how Arkin commands his warships. This is the break we've been waiting for, a direct line to the enemy fleet. Start a plan of attack. It's Arkin's turn to be on the defensive. I feel like it's not just that simple. We found his, his weakness, right? He relies on on the droids that are the same, right? Gemini, who, or Gemini, which is the same as Scorpio. Scorpio is the main one, but they rely. Yeah, sure, he relies too much Scorpio on these droids, but all the data Havoc squad and feel like there's something. We still haven't uh, figured out what Scorpio truly maps. wants. We found something unexpected. There's a hyperwave relay station hidden 10,000 meters beneath the spire. It's the only source of Gemini frequency transmissions to and from the Eternal Throne. Let me know when you get to the exciting part. I knew you'd take my briefing seriously. Lana, you're up. That relay station is our key to the Gemini frequency. If we can decrypt it, we'll eavesdrop on the enemy and learn his plans. Or destroy all communications. If we take it out, Arkin won't only be blind, he'll be toothless. The fleet will sit there waiting for commands that never arrive. First order of guerrilla warfare. Disrupt enemy communications. This is a demolition off all the way. You'll never get near that relay station. It's 10 kilometers underground and defended by more safeguards than we can count. Well, it's a good thing our data reveals every security measure in the way and how to defeat them. A strike team can disable the defenses right under Arkin's nose, but only if we send it in now. Our intel's turning stale as we speak. Kaleo and Major Jorgen are already on Zakul. They're in position to clear the commander a path directly to the relay station. We are not sending that terrorist. He's done enough to my world. Senya's right. I can't believe I had to say that. Havoc Squad was made for this op. We have enough detonite to turn that relay station into a crater. Cut the head off the serpent. Throw the fleet into chaos. You're trusting the fate of the galaxy to a gang of grenade-happy bucketheads? We're only getting one shot at this. Lucky for you, one shot is all I need. Oh, is that what you tell all your victims? Destroying that relay station is a bonehead play. 
Send me, and you'll control the Gemini frequency. The idea has potential, and she's an experienced infiltrator who survived under Cool for years. She bombed my people. Never again. That's a rough um, option right there. Boys, I don't know what kind of options I I can really take here. I don't like Gord, uh, Jorgen, but uh, Kaleo, I don't like her. But I don't. At least I like her a little bit more than Jorgen. And I don't like the fact that he's an unsubordinate, unsubordinate uh, bitch. Like, either way, it's going to go bad. I feel like we need the soldiers to do it. I don't trust the terrorists to do anything. All right, an anarchist doing anything at all is bad. It's on its own. So I'm, I'm choosing the ones that are actually going to listen to me. Destroying the relay station is a last resort. But if things go wrong, I need someone who can get creative. That's Kaleo. She's like a rancor on a glass factory. This is a mistake. You're a mistake, my guy. You're the one who never listens to me. A decoy mission is vital. On the second thought, I agree. My decision, my decision is final, Jorgen. Go fuck off and do uh, do drink with your buddies or something. I don't need you. I never, I never will. Those are my orders. They're not open to debate. Your job is to keep Arkin away from us. I'm already moving. Be seeing you. I know it wasn't the right tactical choice, but it, may be prudent to consult but it was the right emotional choice, boys. I swear, I don't like Jorgen. I don't want him to have anything to do with any like important missions. I don't like Kaleo either, but I trust her way more than I trust a goddamn soldier who doesn't listen to orders. So now we gotta go back to the cantina. I don't know what's next. We actually have... Five messages. Holy shit, that's a lot of messages. Let me uh, take a look at these because before entering this. So just a message right there that you guys can read. Dr. Agrab. Uh, please instruct CN2 to kindly step away from my experiments. Okay. What about you? Seb Lorad. What is this? Uh, really? Kaleo? I have to hear uh, from some slime ball as <laughs> act dealer that you are out in wild space now. Two years I've waited for you, and you couldn't even uh, send a message. I thought you might be dead. Uh, though the bounty hunters had finally caught up uh, to you. Well, I can not uh, I can take a hint. I saved up for the club. We said we'd, we, we'd end up uh, open together. Okay. Well, I guess I don't need the credits anymore. Take them. That was all I was ever good for, right? Note from uh, Terran. It just says six more messages like this one, all from different people. I try not to judge personal lives, but tell me this isn't evidence to keep Kaleo at Adam's length and use her skills appropriately. Okay, I don't, I don't know, boys. I have no idea who that guy or girl is. I don't remember any, like, I don't, I don't remember that name at all. It must be weird, boys. I, I screwed over so many people in my life that uh, I literally don't remember any of them. I just told way too many of them. Okay, I, let me get that. Whatever. I am going to go ahead and open all these crates before we do the mission. There we go. Sell all this shit. And we're good to go. Finally. Let's start the mission up already. We're outside. We're supposed to speak with Valkorian. Some nice and quiet peace time would be good. Maybe he could tell me his next plan because I have no idea what his plan is, to be honest. Alright, let's do, uh, let's rock around, I guess. What is all this? Wait, uh, wilderness survival gear, what the fuck? Okay, let's pick that up. Don't know what I need, I need that for. What is, energy shield, medical med pack, what the hell? What are we running around here for? Korean, we need to talk. Your life is defined by deeds, not words. And we have nothing to discuss. When you kneeled before me, I thought you would become my greatest ally. Ah, how wrong I was to believe. What the fuck that. did I do to you? 
This is no time to agree. You've been holding out on me. You know what? You kind of been disappointing yourself, my guy. I built an alliance to punish Arkin for what he's done. I've honored our bar. Yeah, I did what I, I, you asked you me the to same. do. What about you? I am not your servant, and you have trifled with my patience for the last time. The fuck are you talking about? You lost your mind, Valkorion. I literally did everything you could ask for. I built a fucking alliance just for him. I did everything he asked, but still ungrateful. This son of a bitch, man. What is what a loser he is, I swear. Lana, come in. Something happened. I need your help. She's it's just she's not gonna answer. Your friends cannot hear you. You isolated me for a reason. I'm sick of you. Let me go. Am, am I having another dream? Uh, you isolated me for a reason, my guy. You brought me here. Why? Sometimes evolution requires a push or a sacrifice. You want to go into another body now? You really want to bounce on me? You have forgotten what it means to face death alone. I have I've never forgotten. I don't know what you're talking about. Has been laid before you, but you refuse to tread upon it. That will change. Okay, you've lost your goddamn mind, Valkorion. First off, everything you're saying is not true. Can you sense the predators closing in? Mm, they smell your weakness. They would feast on it. I don't know what's wrong with you. I've done, I've done nothing wrong to you. First off, I've worked with you since the beginning. And this is how you repay me right now? By trying to kill me? Like, honestly, come on, dude. This is not, it's not cool. Really is uncool right now what you're doing. You better stop right now, man. Or our deals might be, uh, might be done for. I don't have to, like, I don't have to do this shit. It's getting really ridiculous pretty fast, man. I swear. I'm doing everything in my power to help him, and uh, he's still ungrateful. Like, he's still. He's, he's a Sith after all, right? He's acting like a true Sith, I guess. We're making progress, my guy. Just shut the fuck up and let me do my thing right now. You want me to show you how we survive alone? That's how we survive alone. There we go. This cave has collapsed. Okay. Let me just fill myself up right here. Look. I don't know what your problem is. We'll, uh, we'll find out real soon. I actually don't want to fight these dudes. There's no point in me fighting them. Literally no point in me fighting them. Where's the, the next cave? There's got to be a cave somewhere here because... Uh, I do see something. Like I see one of the points right here. So... Let me see if there's a cave here. I'm not gonna fight you guys. I ain't gonna happen. Uh, that's not ha that's not happening. All right. I'm too busy doing uh, other things. There we go. This case collapsed. I'm just gonna look at everything. Search for a path back to Edison. Are we not on that Edison anymore? For fuck's sake. What have you done? What have you done, buddy? Okay. Let me just. There we go. Gonna jump. Oh, all right, all right. There we go. We're just, we're just gonna jump, boys. There we go. There we go. Just like that. Why don't you just leave me alone, you Sith stalker sons of bitches? Holy shit! I'm getting, like, I'm getting attacked from all different places here. I can't barely see anything. It's really dark in here. Under a single banner. It should have been yours. Okay. You know, you're really starting to piss me off, Valkorion. You don't want to piss me off. You know that, right? Oh my god, there we go. Good lord. What, uh, where do we go next? Is that the last one? I see, I think I see it. I see like a path right here. Where's the, uh, where's the last one? It's gotta be somewhere here. Hold on, boys. We're gonna figure it my out. My son struck a killing blow against you. Had I not interfered, you would be dead. Perhaps I should have let you go then. 
If you really, really wanted to kill me, you would have done it a long time ago. All right, you want to work with me? Despite you need me. Warship, a legion of allies and my immense power at your disposal, you remain incomplete. Talking shit a lot. For someone that talks shit, man, you sure don't do the much. Send your little pets to me, right? But you can't do shit to me. You're you overly are ridiculous, Valkorian. And instincts are not enough to secure victory, Hunter. I've done that in my sleep. What you? What's next? Until you embrace your full potential, you will only be a pawn of fate, never its master. Mastering fate is impossible. Well, why don't you just show me how, old man? If you have all the answers, let's hear them. Start with why you let your son betray you. Arkan saw what he wanted and claimed it. What is your excuse for failing to do the same? The future is not a river to carry us. It is the ocean in which we drown if we are not prepared. You have two destinies, Outlander. In one, you defeat Arkan, claim the Eternal Throne, and remake the galaxy. In the other, you die alone, unmourned and forgotten. I brought you here to taste that defeat. Oh, we're fighting you now. All right. Is that what's going on here? All right, buddy. All right. How about I kick your ass, Dan? Good old-fashioned way. Let's do it. I'm all open to it. Hey, I don't even need heroics to fight you. Where are you going? You're running away. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can, yeah, you can laugh all you want. You're the one who's running away when we're fighting. You're a funny guy, my guy. You really think you stand a chance against me? All right. You wanted to talk shit earlier. I'm about to talk shit to you, my guy. Let's go. How about I do uh, some sort of energy shell just to help me out a little bit right here. There we go. Oh my god. Dude. He does look uh, do a lot of damage though. Without my heroics, it might be bad. Listen, can we talk this out? Because my med pack is absolutely garbage. It doesn't do anything for me. How about I do this to you? There we go. A little bit of a tranquilizer a little bit. There we go. Double shield. I'm gonna heal myself up. Let's go, boys. Oh, don't run away, my guy. Don't you just run away right now. I've got plenty of things to do to you. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, no, you don't. How about I freeze you a little bit? Man, every time, man, it just goes away. Why did I ever believe you could change anything? Well, you tell me. You don't know me at all. Shut up or finish the job. Jeez. You want me dead? If that's what it takes to get rid of you, do it. I will not gift you that release. Not yet. This was a fraction of the pain my children can inflict. If you do not finish your training, become something greater. You will feel the full weight of their rage. Training? I'm no Jedi. I'm a simple bounty hunter. What you want me to do? I can endure anything. You know what? Training. You're actually funny, my guy. You really think I need training? I've taken down common thugs, giant monsters, and everything in between. I'd say I'm done training. You do not perceive the path ahead, even when it is obvious. Let that be your first lesson. I cannot stay to protect you any longer. There are matters to which I must attend. But I will leave you with the final token of my favor. All right, that's what I'm talking about. That's more like it. 
That's more like it. Fulfill your destiny. And I promise to return. Okay. Return and I'll destroy you. You promised to be... Uh, we promised we'd be allies. First off, remember that. Remember that, my guy. We made a, we made a deal. I bent my knee to you. I gave you my loyalty in exchange for your power. You have received all that I can give. Now, one day there may be more. Until then. Good lord. All that power that he's giving me is for nothing though, because it's gonna kill me. It's too much for my body to to hold. I'm not a Jedi, I'm not a Sith, like I'm not a force sensitive. So I can't be holding these powers. This is bad, man. Cheer up, big brother. You're making me sad. Father won't face me himself. He's punishing you for stealing his chair. He isn't angry. Father never feels anything. Not even when I... When Thexen died. He was a good brother. Brought me gifts from all the worlds he conquered. I freed you from father's control. I hope that earned your support. My loyalties lie here, Arkan. Always. She didn't say they uh, had that they were to you, though. She said here, not you. Watch out, Arkan. We've woken up. Where the fuck are we? Well, I don't know where we are, boys, now but... What? At least we're not dead. This looks like, um... This looks like my ship. What the fuck? It looks exactly like the... What's it called? The the ship, but one of the class ships, right? I think it's the Jedi chi uh, ship right there. It's exactly the Jedi ship. What the fuck is this? What's going on here, boys? What have we awakened to right now? Oh yeah, let's find out what's going on here. Jedi Battle Master. I don't know what any of these mean. Discover clues about your location in the area. Do we have anything here? I woke up here. That's the only clue I can find out right now. We don't have a galaxy map or anything. Like, okay. All these little green things are the things I can actually take a look at, I guess. Uh, other green things? Do we have other, uh, other other green things that we can look at? I don't think so. We got a Jedi that uh, literally li we're living on uh, close to a Jedi or Sith, boys. I don't know what's going on here. Titan training guns. Okay. I know what's going on here, boys. I know just what's going on. We got. I know who's there. Appears to be under construction. Okay. Bonus lost holocron archive their knowledge in holocrons these legacies preserve the wisdom of great minds only those connected to the force may use these devices Valkorian's influence has granted you limited access but it will be enough there is wisdom in these holocrons for one who would create lasting change in the galaxy what the fuck yeah we equipped we just unlocked the holocron nobody except for force sensitives can unlock holocrons that means that uh, my power my power is now truly great. It's Valkorian, the Valkorian in me, being able to use the holocrons and stuff. Because otherwise, I would never be able to do it. A serene place for meditation. Now we all heard that voice. It's clearly Satil Shan. Whether she, I don't know what she wants with me, or why she's brought me here. Well, we'll find out uh, soon enough, I guess. So now we unlocked all the clues. That was an armor by a Jedi. Obviously, we figured out who was here. Uh, just enough, right? We all know it's uh, it's a tail. I can't take my speeder, really. All right, that's gonna be a long walk, boys. 
I mean, I'm no Jedi, so I don't understand how this all this whole meditation or old training thing goes. Usually, training for us, right, means going on the hunt, shooting a bunch of stuff. I've waited for you a long time. Have you now? Have we met before? I feel Welcome like we haven't. My home, Outlander. <laughs> Please be real. Oh boy. Am I going to start flirting with, a je with uh, the Grand Master? Refresh my memory about you? You know what? Let's try to flirt with her. Why not? It would be funny. Jedi Master Satil Shan. I dreamed about meeting like this. Tell me it's really happening this time. Whatever you believe this is, I'd rather not know. <laughs> That's what's funny. I, I had dreams about you. I don't There's think you want to know these dreams, you. though. Stop rushing me. You survived an ordeal. Come, sit. There's food. <laughs> you know what? Don't test me. Don't test me, Jedi. I know what this is. The only reason you're still alive is to satisfy my curiosity. Not hungry. Fine. More for us. Many things changed while you slept in Carbonite. I led the fight to save the Republic from Zakul. Nothing prepared me to face that enemy. I failed. Again and again. That's because this you're a loser. Revan would have He's done so much more than you. Even Bastille, Bastille Ashan would have done more. I gave myself to the will of the Force. I left the Core Worlds and found this planet. We've been here for years, waiting. <laughs> so you aren't alone. You know what? Waiting for me. Alright, you know what? You're kind of a coward. The will of the Force? You left the galaxy to be conquered by Arkan. Many confuse reaction for taking control. But there is power in stillness. We sensed your awakening on Zakul. Felt the presence of our old enemy guiding you. We witnessed the victories and defeats leading you here. When we found you in that clearing, we faced a choice. Bring you here. Or end you there. Oh, end me there. And you came to your senses. You know what? I'd say you're, you're too weak to kill me, actually. You're probably too weak. You wouldn't be able to touch me. Even if you, you wanted to. You don't have the stomach to kill anyone. I can kill when necessary. Today it isn't. You've changed in ways we still don't understand. Whatever his reasons, Falcorian has opened you to powers and a destiny. Far beyond the horizon of your old life. You have much to learn. Follow us. Seek the answers throughout the valley. You will know when you find them. I'm gonna stick right here for now, boys. And end the video. Don't know about this Satil Shan character. I tried to flirt with her and then uh, didn't really work. She doesn't want none of me, so I'm just gonna be a, uh, a I'm just gonna be uh, an enemy to her then. I don't really like Jedi's. You all know history, our history with Jedi's, right? The whole bounty on my head thing still sorts in my mind. So I'm not a fan of uh, Satil. For sure, that's uh, that's one thing that's for sure. So let's just remember to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.